guys, you're with me, Kevin, your scuba professional, and today we're here to review the Mares Pioneer Front Zip Wetsuit. This has long been one of Mares' most popular selling suits, the Pioneer Suit, a dive standard with divers around the world because Mares are renowned for making top quality, really robust wetsuits and scuba gear. So let's dive into the suit, check out all of its features so we know exactly what's going on. First thing to point out, these suits come in both men's and ladies cuts. At the moment, I am reviewing the men's Pioneer front zip wetsuit. So that's Mare's men's. The suit also comes in the Mare's Pioneer front zip sheet up for the ladies. Uh, the differences being mainly that the men's has got bumps for the men and the ladies has got bumps for the ladies in all the right places. Uh, the men's one does have this red trim. The ladies one has more of a lilac-y type color. You'll see the pictures on the on the website. It's got a little tattoo down the side of it as well. But they look very, very similar. Majority of the suit black itself. But the features of each suit are exactly the same. So let's start at the top and work our way down. First thing we see is that it's the Mares front zip, so it's got this great big zip down the bottom over there. So the, the main benefit there being that it's very easy to zip the suit down, so you don't get that gag reflex when you are sitting on a boat from the wetsuit tickling your throat over there. So that's a plus of the suit. It's also very easy to get into the suit, you can just slide it over and you can zip it up yourself. However, one thing I have noticed with this particular suit is very difficult to get off yourself. So you quite ha quite often have to get your buddy, you zip down, you get your buddy to pull the suit down and that makes it much easier to get it off yourself. However, do not fall for that dirty little diver's prank where they pull the suit halfway down and you get stuck like a penguin there and someone gives you the double purple nurple. It's not so cool. If you don't know what that means, You'll find out one day if you buy this suit. So there's the review of the, the, the front zip of the suit itself. We see it's broken down into multiple panels the whole way around. One of the things I really like on the suit is over the shoulder over here, it's got that rubberized paint, little grippy stars that have been painted all over the show. I know it's a challenge to see on the camera, but this just gives the suit a lot of extra robustness or protection over the shoulder because when you've got your BCD on, it's always rubbing up and down during the, the dive itself. So that just helps with a little bit of a longevity there. There's lots of panels around the suit itself making it really ergonomically designed when you're sitting in it uh, yourself. Moving down to the legs, both the left and right have that similar rubberized paint put on the front of it. That'll just help protect the knees if you're kneeling down on the beach rubbing it against it when you're on a, on a boat. Should you occasionally rub into the coral or the bottom of the beach sand, something you should never do, rub against the coral, but should you accidentally just rub up against the coral, this will protect the suit itself. One of the key features of this suit, it's on the wrists and on the ankles, is this graphite seal. You can see that's a semi-dry type seal that they've got there, like a graphite paint that just reduces the amount of water that travels up the suit itself, which also helps to make it super warm. So that's on the arms and the legs itself. On this left hand leg, same thing with the paint down the, the bottom, rubberized paint as well as the, the graphite seal. Lots of panels, as I said, on the suit, but also lots of stitching the whole way around. Top tip from me is, uh, should you notice that one of these bits of stitching, not particularly on the suit, but on any suit, should you see that it starts to run, just dab a bit of nail varnish on there, a little touch of super glue, and that should just stop it from, from running, and that'll save the suit quite a, quite a bit as well. Um, over the arms, this is Mara's Pioneer. It's got some really great red um, neoprene in there. And let's flip around and have a look at the back back of the suit quite a few panels as well not much going on other than the panels itself there's two little ticks or v's they do serve a purpose as well what these do because it's also that rubberized paint is it gives the bcd something to grip on when you're underwater so it stops the bcd floating around or reduces the amount that that bcd can move around making you feel a lot more secure and stable in the in the water itself um, a few other panels built in over there helping with the, the ergonomic design as well. If we look on the inside of the suit, it's just the standard neoprene that it's got there. It doesn't have any of that furry skin. It's just standard neoprene across the top. It does have the graphite paint at the top just to give you a little bit more water resistance when you're, when you're diving. But the overall, the suit is warm enough for temperate to slightly chillier waters. And the best thing of all is it comes with a free hoodie, which is really, really cool. So Mara's providing the free hood, 
The hood has a little hood clip which can clip onto the front of the zip over there, so for storage purposes. And it's a great hood just to keep you warm. It's got a nice big neck seal over there which you can tuck into the seat. Just to point out where those little tattoos are at the top, there are little holes in the, the hood itself. Those are there on purpose. It's not a manufacturing default. They are there to allow the air that gets trapped in your hood as you breathe out just to escape. Before they had these, you used to swim around like a mad little cone head underwater. One of the hacks we used to do is take a soldering iron, heat it up really hot and just melt a hole in the top of the, in the, top of the hoodie. But it never looked really cool. However, this looks amazing. Some great detailing that the guys from Myers have put together for us there. So that comes for free with the Myers Pioneer front zip men's and she dive suit this is going to be on uh, the men's and ladies suits men's and ladies product on our website the she dive as i said just having the bumps for the ladies and a slightly different uh, color tone and a few little accent changes but overall it's pretty much exactly the same suit itself so there's my review of the Mares Pioneer front zip wetsuit. It comes in design for men's with bump for men. And it comes in a ladies or sheet off cut with bumps for the ladies to make it super, super comfortable. Value for money wise, this is a really, really great suit. A very, very popular suit around the world. You'll see a lot of Mares Pioneers. Comes in the front zip and back zip version. Back zip a different product line on the site. You can go check that out if you wish. But the front zip, super, super comfy to wear. So there's my review of the Mares Pioneer 5mm wetsuit, ideal for temperate and tropical type diving, which is really, really cool. If you guys are enjoying these product reviews, please feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel or go to our social streams, main one being facebook.com forward slash scuba.co.za. We'll keep you up to date with all our trips and travels and all the other funky things that we've got on the go because we're really great to grab you guys out on a dive one day. We've also got really great specials on our website on an ongoing basis, which you can always follow on those social streams. So that's it from me guys and I look forward to seeing you really soon in the water.